KARK 4 News at 5. Congratulations, new citizens. 29 new Americans from 22 countries completed their citizenship process this morning at the Clinton Presidential Center. Each took an oath of allegiance before a federal judge pledging their love to the country. Love seeing these things. Niels Orang shares how a few also saw this as an act of love for a wife and husband. That's right, Bob Laura. It was a very fitting time for these new Americans to finish the nationalization process just a week after Valentine's Day. The ceremony was another vow of no turning back on their loved one or their country. The American flag, an enduring symbol of liberty and freedom. For 49 new Americans, it's a symbol of a years long journey. The American dream is it's, it's just the end of the road, but the beginning of a new life. Marius Nagalo became a citizen five years ago, and his wife Muriel did the same Wednesday. Both were born in Burkina Faso, Africa. We were a uh, college fit hard. They dated for six years before becoming married, and because of the naturalization process and waiting on a green card. We have to to live apart uh, five years yeah. before being together. This day gives them the security they will never have to separate again. The American experiment does not work without folks like you. From Mongolia to Iraq, India to Honduras, each person has a story. I met an American out and about uh, at the bar. Chantel met Jared Bryce when they were both teaching in South Korea. He's from Arkansas, but her family is from Canada. They were joking that I could have just crossed the border if I wanted to marry an American that badly. <laughs> now 13 years into their marriage, she solidified a place with the family they made, and like many before her, an adopted country. You're part of, of something big, uh, bigger than you. So many incredible and fun stories in that room, and it goes far beyond them. According to the U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services, our country welcomed nearly 7.5 million naturalized citizens over the past decade. Niels Rang, back to you too.